The baddest woman on the planet is here. There is only one. Rowdy Ronda Rousey. The following contest is an Extreme Rules match. Making her way to the ring from Venice Beach, California, the Raw Women's Champion, the baddest woman on the planet, Rowdy Ronda Rousey. Ronda Rousey's got her game face locked. She is ready to compete. It's time for some mayhem. And her opponent, from Lafayette, Indiana, Ruby Ryan. Ruby Ryan has said all along, if I would was in the business of pleasing people, I wouldn't be here. I'll do things the way that I want to do them. As tough as they come, rebels against the norm. If you don't like what Ruby Riot's about, she doesn't care. You can feel the electricity running through this arena. This is going to be some battle, one-on-one, -on -one, mano a mano. And with the women's division as white hot as it is right now, you just know this match is going to be one for the ages. A lot of times you see champs dial it back a bit when the title's not on the line, but I don't expect to see that from her here. Here we go with Ruby Riot. And the knee gets her good. You're going to need to find a way to mount an offense here. If you're worried about her now, you haven't seen many of her matches. She can withstand oh. so much more punishment than this. Amazing move there. That's it. It's over. It's over. When it comes to matches like this, I'd say the more innovative a superstar is when it comes to offense, the better chance they have of victory. She comes up big with the reversal. Things starting to go the other way for her. As Byron mentioned, innovation certainly is a key in a match like this. A competitor can't be adverse to taking action outside the ring. By no means is this your traditional contest. No, it's not, Cole, but at the same time, you still win this match the old-fashioned way by pinfall or submission. You never know what you're going to see in a match like this. And if you need proof of that, just go back to watch Daniel Bryan versus Kane from Extreme Rules 2014. She gets it with the fist. Look at her go. Startles her with the uppercut. I think she's trying to prove a point here. As Corey mentioned, Daniel Bryan versus Kane from 2014 provided scenes we never thought we'd see. Most notably for me was Bryan carrying Kane back to the ring via a forklift. 
That's not out there, Michael, but let's not forget that was also the match where Kane went through a flaming table. the mark. That's all she wrote, fellas. What a brutal beating we've seen dished out so far here tonight. Now it's Ruby Riot. Well, she wants this win bad. And she looked like she had no chance just a few moments ago. Back in from the floor. Man, I think we're seeing the end for Ruby Riot. This may very well be the beginning of the end for her. That's over at this point. Ronda Rousey's done playing. So painful. She's got it now. Trust me, you do not want to get caught in that move. Whoa, she escapes the stretch. You sound surprised, Cole. Come on, there's no way she was going to tap to that. Rip it in the eyes and the face. She goes for the cover. One, two, kick out at two. Oh, that may have been a slow count. Wow, I am impressed. She's starting to get on a roll. She goes for the cover. Two, three. There's the pin. It's over. It's all over. No doubt that was a match people will be telling their kids about for years to come. Here's another look. I can watch highlights of that one all night long. One of the great WWE matches I've ever been able to watch. Count yourselves lucky, people. You might watch WWE for years and only see a match that good a few times. Epic. Here is your winner, the baddest woman on the planet, Rowdy Ronda Rousey. An amazing contest comes to a close following a decisive pinfall victory. And talk about displaying a never-say-die attitude.